All right, listen up, everybody. I've seen a lot of, I guess, hot takes across social media regarding Microsoft, Activision, Call of Duty, and Halo. And some of it is just like, it's just so outlandish that I can't really believe it. But the short of it is that because Microsoft is quote unquote buying Call of Duty and Activision, that they're just not gonna care about Halo, that they're done with Halo, that Halo is now the redheaded stepchild and they don't, you know, won't support it, won't give it money, blah, 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 blah. And there are these, you know, Twitter investigators, these detectives, these I have sources within Microsoft and 343 saying that this is the facts. It's just, you know, people don't care about Halo, especially Microsoft. And while I do not work for Microsoft, I do not work for 343, I'm not even a businessman. I would hope that, you know, people can kind of see that this is just not true. We have to remember that Twitter now, you know, will pay people basically to tweet hate, rage bait inducing tweets to get, you know, replies and engagement and stuff so that they can make a little bit of cash. But people have really been running away with this, just posting just nonsense. So I'm here to tell you that in my personal opinion, this is just, it's not true. It's not going to happen even if and when Microsoft acquires Activision and Call of Duty comes under the umbrella. Halo is not going to be forgotten. One of the most successful IPs, even when it's not being successful, I'm sure you can hear my chair creaking, that, you know, will pull in money, especially each release. Like, how many 250,000 people played Halo Infinite on release? Like, people care about Halo, and as much as we like to fight within the community saying, you know, Halo's dead, blah, 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 like, people still want Halo to be good. People still want it to be successful. People want to play Halo. And even though the ball has been kind of dropped here and there in the most recent releases, people still want that hit of Halo. It's such a special franchise to so many people. And Microsoft knows that. A lot of people have been saying that, you know, money is being taken away from 343 and whatnot. And really, to me, it just looks like Microsoft is making sure that the money that is allocated to 343 is being used responsibly and correctly. And I think that's kind of what a lot of those termination of contracts and, you know, letting people go was all about. You know, we've heard that there was redundancy within the studio, maybe a misallocation of funds and priorities. And that's what I think is happening right now is they're just you know, dialing in and making sure that going forward, it's efficient. There's not a lot of red tape bureaucracy politics involved and that they can create a good Halo game. Now, if you think that's a hot take, let me know in the comments down below. In fact, let me know your opinions. This is an opinion video, so of course I want to know your opinions. You can let me know if I'm wrong. You can let me know if I'm right. You could also subscribe to the channel because we're grinding away towards 15,000 subs and I would love to hit it this year, but I need your help. Also, shameless plug, I'm going to leave my Twitch link down in the comments. You guys should go follow me over there. I stream and stuff and play with viewers and blah, 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 blah. It's a lot of fun and I love all of you. But yeah, basically this whole scare tactic thing about Halo, you know, going to the wayside and being forgotten about and we'll never see another Halo game and all that stuff is just not, that is not happening. I would hope with all the things that 343 has done with MCC and what they've been doing with Infinite and Season 5, which I'm going to have a video on soon about how spicy Season 5 is looking. We've had a few leaks and whatnot, so I'm very excited for the future of Halo. Even when it felt like we were in the worst timeline and, you know, there was the huge hiring freeze and everybody was being let go, the restructuring of 343 has really increased my copium, hopium tanks. And also, I enjoy playing Halo Infinite, so it's not that hard for me to be, like, excited for the future. But that's going to do it for the video, ladies and gentlemen. If you enjoyed, make sure you leave a like down below. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, and I will catch you around the ring.